I watched the new Black Panther movie, Black Panther Wakanda Forever. And it wasn't bad. I just have to say one thing. And that is that I am... No, I'm just kidding. We, are, we ain't gonna do that. Marvel is back, and Marvel is back with a kick in the nuts. This movie is insane. Shuri is the new Black Panther, and the more got some beef. I think Shuri fits the role of Black Panther pretty well. And honestly, we haven't seen much of her, but I think this will be a good time for Marvel. Let's talk about some of the fight scenes. Now, I was really hyped for the, like, the grand finale fight. Uh, because one of the fights in like the in the city in, like in the night with the girl and Shuri and that other person really had some potential. So please Marvel. Please step up with the fighting. What is that grand finale fight with Namor and Shuri? How how is that epic? How is that epic? <laughs> Anyways, let's get D let's just not care about the fight scenes for a second. Now you might say that we didn't need this movie. And yes we do. We need a movie to introduce the new Black Panther. Imagine if you were watching the new Avengers movie or even worse She-Hulk. And Shuri as Black Panther just showed up and then kind of like explained it in like the series of the movie. That you would be so pissed. And if you think that we don't need a new Black Panther, don't say that will make my that will make my point not valid. Now my friend Mr. Er plays YT said that uh, what's his name? He's Bilbo Baggins. It's Bil Bilbo. That his character was pointless, but I I don't think he was because you need to understand that what's happening in Wakanda affects the whole world. And there are people that need to like, like say things about it. Like the news is all over the news. I I don't think it's worth. Even though he has like what like five minutes of screen time, maybe less. You need to know that there are people in the world, like the rest of the world outside of Wakanda, who this affects. I don't know what to say, man. This has been. It's a pretty short video, mind you, but I had to get it out in time, and it's pretty late already, so I'm just gonna say it. This movie was a 8.3 out of 10.